Hey yo, what's going on? It's your boy JP bringing you episode 33 of our legacy of the Daughters and Let's Play. So last episode, we dueled Night Shroud and we didn't really have too much of a great issue, but it was actually quite a weird video. So anyway, excuse me, today we're going to be versing the vampire herself in the Field of Screams. So let's hope that there isn't a ton of <laughs> reading before this gets boring. So anyway, let's get right into it. The second Shadow Rider, Cambula, defeated Dr. Crowler and Zane, taking both their spirit keys and trapping their souls into dolls. It was up to Jaden to put an end to their madness. Alright, Cambula, I'm here for my friend's souls, and I'm not leaving till I get him. Truth be told, dear, you're not leaving here ever again. Not a single one of you are. Camilla, get your game on. And I mean on high. Because when someone does my powers and turns their souls into some dolls, it puts me in a bad mood. And let me tell you something, I don't care. And maybe this will change your mind. Nice and short. Just, I'm not even going to finish that, but... Hey, that, that didn't take forever. Alright. So no matter what I say, some person is just going to take it really weirdly. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let's go. Alright, so straight up. Oh yeah, I actually got a pretty cool hand. Alright, so let's see, do we have Shining Flare Wing Man in here? Because we should, and we do. We have one single Shining Flare Wing Man. Huh. Sweet. So first things first, I think I want to set Clayman I just passed. I could go into Rampart Blaster, but there isn't really a point considering I can't even attack right now. And I highly doubt that she will get a high attack monster on the field. And we have two Clayman anyway, so it doesn't even matter too much. Now please, please don't be a goddamn Mirror Force. Knowing my luck, it will be. Alright, so, luckily, we did in fact get out, no, 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 this one, yes, alright, sweet, <laughs> I'm glad we got this, because knowing Camilla's deck, it's most likely going to have a bunch of reoccurring zombies, so the fact that we have someone that can attack into everything at once, is kind of good, and I can not notice that, you just in case, no, what she's gonna like a regeki or dark hole, but doing that just in case because you never know what can happen. And sweet, she did not, in fact, have a mirror force on her. But I'm still kind of afraid for next turn because of who knows what we, what she can do really. Vampire Kingdom. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh. Well, this isn't good at all. Kinda wish that we had this the last turn or a skyscraper. Crap. Now I don't really wanna summon the standard tricks because of I may need her for a shining flare or a flare wing man if I can manage to get a skyscraper. Uh, I don't know, it's it's kinda of worry because uh Oh, we just got a third claim, man. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you know, yesterday I was playing some duels on Death Pro, right? And I was using my DDD deck, and in my very first turn, <laughs> if this is a real person, be so annoyed, but in my very first turn, I drew three Lore of Darkness. I was like, what the hell? How does this even happen? And guess what, boy? You're getting banished. <laughs> Sweet. And have two Bastina tricks so I can even do use one. Sweet. I like this. Alright. So, hopefully, we can continue to poke her for a little bit of damage. That would actually be really good on our part because we don't really have much rent. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, this isn't good. Crap. Wait, what? How did you just... Uh, 
Wait, what's your effect? Wait, but did Clement wasn't weakened, was he? Hold up. I need to view uh this card switch on the target. Okay, that's what's saying. What's this one? It just inflicts battle damage, right? Yeah, what? I'm so confused. What the fuck? I'm actually how Am I like retarded? Was that just an avion that she just destroyed? How the fuck do we even get an avion? I don't know. But one thing I sure do know is I seriously wish that we didn't. Oh no! I should have put her in attack mode, attacked into something suicide, special summon Bubble Man. Ah, that would have been great. And now I'm gonna die. Now I'm gonna live, but I'm probably gonna die next turn because next turn I'm gonna get. Well, oh, that's how. Yeah, never mind, I wasn't paying attention. So, how did she get over claiming? That's weird. But seriously. Ah. This is the defeat. Uh, I mean, if I attack into something, I guess it'll be alright. Alright. This is basically our last bit. I know that using this will send like another. Ah, no! I knew I shouldn't have. I should have stuck with my gut. I was thinking to myself, the next card, watch, it's gonna be something great. It's gonna be something which will save me the duel. But I'm still like, oh no, don't worry. It'll just be something useless. Ah, uh, control is destroyed. The battle. Two more in the field. Shuffle with his targets. That ain't bad. So I can just ditch all these. Huh. But then that isn't exactly a good thing ever. Yep. Now, I think I'm going to ditch these two. You and you. Alright, sweet. I'm still most likely going to lose. Unless I can somehow... Okay, I'm glad that he got rid of that. That would have been bad. Draw. Duck hole. Hello. Ah. Now, here's the thing. Avion is weak and all of her cards are strong. So there's absolutely no way if I poked with Avion that he'll be able to survive. Especially with this. Shit. Oh no. Well, that's fun what lasted. Ah, crap. <laughs> Man, DX duels, not gonna lie, unless I'm just getting really unlucky. Kind of harder than the original Yu Gi Oh! ones. You know what? I'm just gonna skip Story Deck. Let's give it another shot. You know, I really like this background. Little hexagon, pentagon, whatever they just were. I wasn't paying attention. But anyway. First was first. Although, I feel like I should go second because of the draw power since we are playing heroes. But against her, we don't really know what's going to happen. And now I'm sitting there thinking to myself, I sure do hope we get pot agreed, but we got both pot agreed and gates for charity. Skyscraper. Hmm. I kind of want to use it, but at the same time, I don't. I'm going to use it. I have to. Two, three. Alright, so first off, fusion gate. Ooh, actually, I could just straight up get myself Shining Flare Wingman. You know what? I'm gonna discard these two right here. You and Skyscraper. Alright. So instead of actually using Fusion Gate this turn, I'm just gonna summon Sparkman and pass. Because of she will hopefully set up some sort of board. 
and then the next turn I'll just fusion the bunch and go into Shining Flare Wingman. And now here's the issue. She set a card. May not sound like much, but what? I gotta attack. Please don't be mirror force. Okay, I just wasted that turn. But it's better that than risking it. Because with me, it's always a goddamn mirror force. And I really don't wanna lose these cards through a mirror force. Alright. I don't know what you're planning. I can declare yeah, I'm just gonna mirror force you. That may not be worth it to some of you guys, but if she was attacking without attacking to a Sparkman, she's gonna have some sort of plan. And not just that, I just wanna clear the board. Ha. Now, here is where the real issue arises. I could get Flame Wingman and Thunder Giant. Or. Actually, I could straight up get Tempest. But there's really no point to get him right now. Uh, no, not you. You. So I can do uh, many things right now. I could go Rampart Blaster. I can go. Wait. Okay, I was about to be like. <laughs> wait, what happened? Yo. That animation is actually really cool. But I'm gonna get this guy right here. Alright, sweet. Flame Wingman. So again, I can either get Sparkman or Fun. I mean, uh, from the Giant or this guy. Huh. It's hard to say. Uh, blah, blah, blah. This gains 300 attack for each here in the graveyard. Uh, if damage equal to attack. Okay. I already knew that. I was just double checking. Thing is, we don't really have any heroes in our graveyard because they're all just getting banished. So then it was just straight off beat. It's hard to say what I should do. Because from the giant is this guy right here is the theme of the whole duel. But I can do a bunch of damage. All right, let's do some calculations. We have 1,900 attack or health left. If I use Thunder Giant, and then I always have this guy in my hand, so if I summon. Dad, everything's getting banished, I have to. There's no reason for me not to go into Thunder Giant. As cool as it would have been to go into Shining Flow Wingman, it's just not worth it when I could be doing all this damage right now. Alright. Now watch, this will be where the Mirror Force comes out and just sort of ruins my day. Alright, awesome. But I've always loved the hero artworks, man. They've just always been so cool. Now please, give me Spark, man. Oh, yo, this works. I'm fired with this. Fusion summoning three badass cards? Flame Wingman, Thunder Giant, and now the soon to be a Wild Edge. Yo, here we go. Huh. So I could use this game's effect. Nah, no point. <laughs> what if I actually did that? Oh, hello. I mean, it doesn't really matter on us, this guy. As some sort of special summoning thing. But anyway, we're gonna attack with Thunder Giant and wrap it off here. Sweet. You know, I'm glad this is a more quicker duel. Oh, Jane defeated Camulon, freeing Zane and Dr. Crown of Soul from their doors. That's game. At least the nightmare is finally over. This one, at least, Camulon was just the second of the Shadow Riders. That means more are coming. Awesome. Boost the pack. Hey, I'd rather Zane for <laughs> Huh. So this is gonna be interesting. These next few. <sighs> oh god, I don't even want to. I mean, ancient. Eh. Eh, I don't know. 
This door is going to be so weird. It'd be fun to use ancient gears, but I don't know. This one's going to be cool. A lot of these are actually going to be really cool, to be honest with you. And we are already 22% complete with this current campaign. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this off here. Just because you can probably tell from my voice, but I'm starting to already get weird. Uh, just because of a haven't really taken a break from recording. So anyway, I'll catch you guys next time. If you have enjoyed, smash out the thumbs up down below. I'll catch you later. Peace out. Bye bye. See ya.